Hello everyone. It is Wednesday, so I'm here to bring you our two-minute skincare drill. So as we wait for people to hop on, I will introduce myself to those of you who don't know me. For those of you who are hopping on for the first time, my name is Claudia Cometa. I am a pharmacist and independent skincare consultant. And I come here every Wednesday to provide you tips, tricks to achieve the best skin of your life. Um, I also come here occasionally on Wednesdays to provide you with some information on the beauty and skincare industry that may impact your personal skincare needs and concerns. So today I wanted to hit on one of those topics and that is animal testing. Um, as many of you know, this is kind of a hot topic and you know most of us try to avoid as much as we can products that are tested on animals. Um, and what I have discovered is that there is actually Sorry about that, just got distracted by a call. A British laboratory called Accelerate that is completely dedicated to never testing on animals. And the way in which they do that is by collecting donated human skin cells from plastic surgery and harvesting those and testing the cosmetics on those cells, which I thought was really interesting. They are sort of setting the tone for being proactive and encouraging other countries and labs to jump on board. So the European Union actually already has banned the use of animals in testing on cosmetics, but many countries, including the US and China, um, are still doing that practice on rel a relatively large scale. So I thought it was really great to point that out that there are laboratories who are sort of paving the way for for the future, which is hopefully no more need to test on animals. If you are interested in finding out if your skincare products or cosmetics are tested on animals, PETA.org, so that's P-E-T-A.org, has a way for you to search for your brand and they will tell you if it is tested on animals or not. So go there and search to see if the products that you are using are tested on animals. Um, and there are plenty of brands that no longer do that, so you may um, most likely will find a good alternative. The company that I represent, Rodan and Fields, does not test on animals. Many other countries, or excuse me, companies are moving in that direction as well. So, hope that was helpful for you. I hope you have a wonderful Wednesday and the rest of your week, and I will see you again next week.